I'll just give you all a view of the Wembley Stadium arch. Ah, just. I hope you all are getting a view of this. It is. This is the SSC Arena, and yeah, there was just some football match uh, held yesterday. I can how far can I go? Yeah. So yeah, you all won't get the best view, but uh, this is where I am. I was out on a walk. Please subscribe to the English Web and do not forget to click the bell icon to stay notified at all times. Hi guys, welcome back to the English Web. I am Bageshri and I am right uh, next to the Wembley Stadium. And uh, yeah, this is my first time shooting outdoors and I thought it would be a fun experience to do so. Uh, I'm sure most of you all would be aware that I've been in London for the last eight months. I'm pursuing a master's program in creative writing. So it's been like seven, seven and a half months since I started the program. I still have um, some five months to go. And the, one of the reasons why actually I came here is, um, was to kind of, you know, be in a place where British English is, um, you know, kind of treated very respectfully. It is actually the capital, um, you know, of the language. And I, it was a dream for me to uh, study here. So it's been a great experience. One of the reasons why I did this video was to let you all know about the observations that I've made with regard to the language after coming here. So the first observation that I uh, came across was, you know, when I heard people uh, call the letter H, uh, H, so you know people don't understand when you say H, it's H, and uh, yeah, so that was the first observation. My second observation was, uh, you know, no, uh, coming to know that uh, chips, you know, the wafers that we kind of usually call crisp, uh, chips, are referred to as crisps over here, and French fries, on the other hand, are addressed as chips. So, you know, I was, I was, you know, I did have, go through some hassle, you know, when I went to McDonald's once and asked for a french fries because nobody understands french fries over here. And, um, yeah, I think one of the other things also that I came across was how people address, uh, you know, like the word grade or standard as class. So if you ask somebody uh, what level or which level he or she is studying at, uh, they would kind of usually say I'm in class 6 or I'm in class 7. Uh, so standard is not being used. Grade is something that is used in the US, but over here people only use class. So um, also a lot of times, you know, I came across people who say what instead of which. So if I were to ask for something like uh, which is your favorite color, people usually say like what is your favorite color. And I remember being so surprised because uh, I am sure you're, a lot of you all would be aware that you know I'm a sucker. Uh, for British English and you know I really don't like to interchange words even if it is which or what but yeah that was quite a revelation and I'm looking forward to kind of you know making many other discoveries over here um, you know and um, yeah I shall let you guys know if there's anything else that I come across and um, you know you all can also follow me on social media I upload uh, you know pictures from my journey in London check the link in the description below and do not forget to subscribe to the English Web. Do like this video. I'm looking forward to growing this channel and my community. So I hope you all keep, uh, you know, enjoying the process of learning English. And yeah, I shall see you guys soon. Goodbye.